day two in the Atacama Desert. Um, I'm currently just walking the streets. I think I'm just gonna get myself lost. Just see where I end up, you know? Yeah. Yesterday, I explored the Atacama Desert a little bit. We went to um, El Valle de la Luna. So, that was really nice. And right now, I'm about to be picked up. It's early morning, I'm about to be picked up to go on a four day trip to Bolivia um, to Uyuni, where the salt flats are. And then I'm going to be dropped back here on the fourth day in Chile. So then I'll make my way down to where I'm studying in Chile. <laughs> Surrounded with the best view and incredible, incredible. I loved it.
amigos. We are in a salt hotel. This the floor is salt. And looking out the window in the kitchen, I can see in the distance the salt plains lift up. It's very exciting. I think tomorrow is the day we go to them, which is so exciting. And crackers. Just got salt flats and about to watch the sunrise. It is incredible. We're in the um, salt flats, and there's a, a cool place with heaps of flags from every country. But for some reason, there is no Australian flag. I'm really, um, I'm kind of upset about it. So, if anyone comes to Bolivia to the salt flats from Australia, make sure to bring an Australian flag to put up here because it needs to be done. in Uyuni and these trains used to export plata which I think is silver um, or bronze, I don't know metal, metal and salt
chilly. As you just saw, I just spent four days in Bolivia. And I'm back in Chile, baby. I'm in San Pedro, the Atacama Desert, which I was in before. And I think I'm just gonna spend one more night here and then I don't know where I'm going. Uh, I'll decide that. That's a future me, that's a future me issue, you know?